Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Sahim from Sahim Tech, and in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a classroom in Google Classroom. Now, this tutorial will be helpful for teachers out there, so they they will be knowing how to create Google classes in Google Classroom. So let's begin. Now, this is gonna be a short, read short video. Here I am in my Google browser. First of all, you can click on the three, um, you know, six dots over here, and you can scroll down until you find Google Classroom. Now, if you don't, that now if you can't find Google Classroom, you don't need to worry. You can just come here to the search uh, search bar and then type in Google Classroom and hit enter. And then now you can see the first one, Google Classroom. Click on that. And then now Google Classroom will open up. Now here you can see create or join your first class. Now if you are a student watching this, that means you're gonna join a classroom, right? I'll make a separate video for that later. So I'll make a video on how to join your first class, your class. Now if you're a teacher watching this, then I'm, I'm gonna show you now only how to create a classroom. So first of all, you have to click on the plus, you know, uh, plus icon over here, and it says create or join a class. Just click on that and then click on create a class and here you have join class so i'm clicking on create classroom and now it's asking me using classroom at a school with students now if you're using is now if you're um, you know teaching in a school and you're using school classroom with students that means your school okay your school must sign up for a free g suite um, um for education account so you can just click on this and then that will take you to that link where you'll have to create a G Suite account. Just click on create starter for free, and then you, can, you just call, this school will do. You want to do it? Just tell them, then they will do it. So I'm closing it now. If you want to learn more about this G Suite for education, I'll put the link down in the description below, and I'll also put the comments, and I'll also type a comment, and I'll pin that comment so they can just have a look at the comment and just click on the link, and then it'll take you to a PDF, uh, which um, which will be uh, and I'll, it'll take you to a the link will take you to the PDF in which there is the full overview of this G Suite for Education. So if you click on the link, that will take you to the G Suite for Education PDF where it is written all the overview of this G Suite you know, for Education. Now if you are just used now, if you don't want to do that, you just want to start directly, you just click on check this box where it says I've read and understood, I've read and understand the above notice. And I'm not using Google Classroom at a school with students. Now you have to check that box and you have to click on continue. And now I have to give the class name. So I'm going to put this English class. Okay. Because <laughs> this random. So here you can give the section. I'm going to just put D. And you can put the subject. Okay, English. And O. Oh, okay. English. Room. Uh, well, nothing. Just put uh, random 12 so okay okay then i can also okay so that'll be good. now you can click on create over here and now it's creating your class if you, if you want to if you don't want to give the room number subject and section it doesn't matter you just have to give the class name that's only the required thing now it's creating my class you can see here it's creating my class just have to wait patiently for google classroom to create the class and now our English classroom is loading up on your page. I you can see it's loading up on the page. Now this is the English class. Now because I put English, Google Classroom will automatically detect a fine wall, you know, theme for your classroom. So you can see now this looks like this theme. You can see this one, this ink, and this feather, you know, that all of these pens and these specs, specs and also uh, a book so it matches so if you don't like it if Google Classroom has not chosen the, the theme of your taste then you can just click select theme over here and then you can just select English and History or if you're using a math class math and science or arts then arts you can see arts here sports then sports stuff now go to English now here you can see this is an English you can see it's English 
And here, this one is world history. This one is world studies. It's also social studies, like in history. Geography, US history. Language arts, and writing. And I'm gonna put this one. Okay, just gonna put it. This has a computer, it's good. So I class theme, and okay, so it's a purple one. It's a purple colored one. It doesn't matter, leave it. So here is your new classroom. Now remember we put the subject in English, you click the arrow, you can see subject is English and the room is 12. I don't know why they asked the room. Anyways, so here is your classroom where you can check your people, your students. Well, I don't have any students over here, you can see my, I don't have any students. And I just have the teacher and that's me. And, good. and here also you can see the grades. Your class doesn't have any students, so you know that what kind of grades will the Google Classroom put. So anyways. So guys, that's how you create a Google Classroom. Now let's go back again to I'm gonna close this window. And now I'm gonna go back to Google Classroom. Okay, just click on the six dots. And classroom. Let's have a look at how it looks. And yeah, we have our English class over there. You can directly open the grade book. You can see this is the grade book. Click on that, it'll open up a grade book where you can see all the grades of each and every assignment or thing you have. Now, your class doesn't have it. Okay. Anyways, I want to tell you that if this video gets more than 15 likes, if this video gets more than 15 likes, I'll, I'll make a video which is going to be a full review of Google Classroom for teachers. So I'm, so I'm going to create a classroom and I'm going to show you how to create assignments, materials, questions, and you know, handling posts and handling grades and returning, you know, the returning assignments and uh, adding private comments and you know, many, many more. So guys, that's how you create a Google Classroom. So, if you found this video helpful, make sure to give this video a like and share with your friends. And if you have any queries, you can mail them directly to me to the mail ID msahim0 at gmail.com or you can just put them in the comment section below. So guys, see you later. Thanks for watching and I'll meet you guys in the next tutorial.